what's up, E-heads? Saturday morning. And we are heading to Kadeem's house. Why are we doing that on a Saturday morning? Well, LA East Skate is another, it's a different route today. They're changing up all kinds of stuff. Uh, the, the ride today is from Santa Monica to Baldwin Hills and back to Santa Monica. And that's kind of, the starting point's kind of far from my house. So we're going over to Kadeem's. We're gonna charge up there a little bit. And we're gonna roll to Baldwin Hills and wait for the crew. Also, Kadeem helped me put my bike into uh, torque mode. And we changed our acceleration time from the stock five seconds to four seconds. And John Angel, uh, popular Onyx owner, YouTuber, he has a blog, he has a YouTube channel. He says you should slowly work your way down in uh, acceleration time. So we might go from four to three. And if you're one of those daredevil type people with a death wish, you could go straight to one second. One second acceleration time would be pretty gnarly. But so we're not gonna do that. We also like our bikes, so we don't wanna we don't wanna mess with anything that's gonna damage the battery or the controller. So we're not in complete sicko mode right now. We're in a hybrid of sicko mode called torque mode, which is about 75% power opposed to the 50% that the bike comes with. And not quite the 100% that sicko mode offers. We just linked up with Kadeem. Adrian joined. And Kadeem messed with my Kelly a little bit, turned my amperage down a little bit so it doesn't cut <clears throat> like it was doing. And he changed my acceleration time to three seconds. No cutting and tons of speed. I like this tune. Oh yeah. It's an electric moped. Sixty. And it'll get there. It'll get there. <laughs> yeah, true, true. It'll get there pretty quick too. Yeah. yeah. Quiet though. Oh, so quiet. No noise. That bike seems light. Yeah, that's true. That's why you got to carry the Bluetooth speaker. Yeah, you should ride hard news and straight bikes. Yeah. Don't not looking at you. Track it. Yep. You can't. No. Nope. You got to be more aware. You got to make sure. Right. You got to make sure everyone sees you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not paying for gas though. Yeah, I sure do. <laughs> it's, a, it's a trade. Do you have to recharge it or recharge yourself? No, you gotta recharge it like an iPhone. You can fix that. <laughs> have a good one, man. Good vibes. We're here. We made it. Woo. You need a tow? Yeah. Oh, you on? Almost. Almost. All right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> One. 
Maybe I'm just not good at it. Maybe maybe I'm just not a good tow truck. I don't know, just might as well. Yeah. Dude, I wish I could change my eco mode yeah. to super eco mode and then have normal be stock sport mode. And then sport, and then sport is, is champ mode, custom champ mode. That looked like a little bit of uh, what's it called? CrossFit. CrossFit. Exercise, but outside. Where everyone can see. CrossFit. Exercise, where you have a perfectly good gym, but you go outside and throw a tire. Oh, there it is. There's the squad. We're here, squad. We got a red onyx with dirty tires. What's up, buddy? Oh, I put a seat on this thing. Yeah. So you gotta try it now. It's, it's a lot easier. So. Uh, hey, can I use that tire? Rear brakes. Only place I've ever seen anyone drive. Whoa. You're, you're on dual yeah. motor already, so. <laughs> That's a bit. That's. <laughs> Ooh, this is a crazy feeling. This is a crazy feeling. We rode this the other day in Long Beach. Now it has a seat and the handlebars have been lowered. <laughs> That's fun. I have a slow scooter, but yeah, these are these are crazy. It's a little. Uh, do you drive like that all the time? Do you keep it in that? Oh, it's kind of hard. I'll, take, I'll turn it off if I'm like in the parking lot or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot, a lot of people are leaving comments like that's such a good deal for fourteen hundred dollars. Oh hey, big boy! What's happening? How's it going? Uh, yeah, I'm always filming, man. I just don't use everything. <laughs> yeah, I feature. Oh my god, they're gonna take this out, and then they're like, I feature illegal activity. Had it already. Had the mob ready, dude. Oh wow. But we didn't want to go anywhere. Pretty good. I gotta find the owner of this red onyx. I think it's wild.
what is this thing? This is a Porsche. Oh, that's one of the cheaper Porsches, isn't it? It's like a Porsche 944. That's the that's the poor man's Porsche, but that was in pretty good condition. What is that? That's a Triumph Spitfire. I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, perhaps it's a Fiat. Or an MG. I'm an e-bike guy, not a car guy. And I still don't know shit about e-bikes. We left the house with 84 point something volts and we're at 79. And you don't want to go lower than 66 if you can help it. Oh, nice. Bike path life. Oh, no. Race ya. Yeah? Yeah, I'll race ya. I'm on low battery, but do you want to do an acceleration test? No. no. Let's not race. How about a braking test? A braking test? Yeah. So you can brake the quickest? You'd probably beat me. I don't know. Find out later. What I like to do is uh, impromptu brake tests on Kadeem. I ask Kadeem, do you want to do a, a braking contest, see who can brake in the shortest distance, and he says no, and then I just surprise him later by slamming on my brakes in front of him as hard as I can with no taillights. That's what I was talking about when I said learn from your mistakes, that's one of our mistakes, that's one of our fails, and now we know not to do that. I used to work at a cannabis doctor's office. Right down 26th here. Just, a, just about a mile, mile that way. I used to get up early, a walk to the train, take two trains to this stop, and then look for a bird scooter to ride the rest of the way. And that's what sparked my love for the E. And then I just learned more and more. And then I stole a bird scooter or two. And then I became a birdman. And then I started wanting to go faster and further. And I wanted to look a little cooler. So I eventually transitioned into e-bike. And then to electric dirt bike. And we've made our way all the way up to electric moped free electric moped
and we're not going back to bird scooters anytime soon. Oh, good? Yeah. Yum! 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 That's the bike I ordered. I ordered the Marine Blue Z1 on February 12th or something. What the fuck is this guy all about? guy was turning right anyways what a piece of shit dude what a fuckhead I know and he was turning right I filmed him. I got yeah that don't do shit What a turd, that guy ruined my day. Dude, that was so fucked. That was so fucked. The guy was making the guy was making a right turn in one block. That's why I saw Sawyer point to me, like, get out of the lane. I thought you, I thought someone was racing behind me, and I was like, yeah, I'm going to let them go, but it was you, and then I just see big old lights, like, just, like, flashing, like. Flashing, shit, I didn't, I didn't have my mirror on me today, so I didn't even see it. No, but, like, dude, we were going at least 45, and he was trying to go, like, 65, 70. I don't know, like, what the fuck is this Oh, we're turning around. Turn around. Ooh, McLaren. And a Bentley. Bentley Continental with a black bumper. Two-tone. This is Santa Monica Pier we're coming up on. Look at Mark, what are you doing? What are you doing? What is this? What on earth are you doing? 
Wait, that guy thinks you're goofy. That guy thinks you're goofy for riding like that. This is Santa Monica Pier. You may recognize it from Grand Theft Auto V. Fun fact, I recorded an episode of Podcast But Outside. Cole Hirsch and Andrew Michon's outdoor podcast right around here somewhere. It was like one of their first podcasts and I was the, the cameraman. Oh, he's, he's coming to talk to he's our cameraman. To cameraman. This might be the end of it. Is it? Oh, this might be it. Oh, I'm not with them. Yeah, no, I'm just filming them because I, I like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not with, I'm not with yeah. them at all. Okay. We're not sure what's we happening. Like, we, yeah, yeah. I mean, let's say that. Why yeah. not? You now he's coming up to us, and we can tell him. Hey, how's it going? So we're just recording audio. We're just audio. recording Is audio. Okay? Just audio? Yeah, yeah, just audio. Just a little audio. Try to pull We're not no, filming no. ourselves, though. No. Thanks, man. Thank you. Yeah, he he's asked if he could film us. We said, yeah. No, we're not together. Sorry. I cannot believe we got away with that. Yeah, we're, we're getting a big thumbs up Don't from the camera. Don't up. give us the thumbs up. And we loopholed the F out of that. We finessed that guy so good before loophole culture even had a name. We were finessing people, not even on e-bikes. We were still embracing loophole culture. The clip went viral on Reddit. Don't see me, but you can see you can hear my voice, and I'm just being loophole as AF. I'm loophole as AF. I've never actually been on this pier, except to kill people in Grand Theft Auto V. going on here a little too much a little too much going on here I've never been here. I mean, I've been to this beach, but I've never been on this boardwalk. We are deep, deep in no, in a no e-bike zone. Oh, he's on a bike. He's on a bike. We'll pedal. We'll pedal out of respect. <laughs> My memory card's almost full. Battery's almost dead. And that is the vlog. Guys, whoa. Thanks for coming with me. Thanks for supporting the channel. Thanks for clicking that like. And thanks for saving a dinosaur 
and for riding e-bikes rather than burning petrol. Peace. Thank you.